at 610. I would like to call our ARPA meeting for Wednesday, March 2nd, 2022. Yes, we call to order, please. Um, I, did, did, did we, we have on the agenda for the next two approve the me meeting minutes from 9 February 9th? But I don't remember seeing them. Who took them? And I don't. I was not here. Is that the one I missed? You were here. Yeah. Did you miss Tara? Uh oh. Yeah. <laughs> um, but no worries. No worries. We we can um, we can come minutes. back to that either next. Um, <clears throat> Well, we're just looking for those because really there's obviously nobody here for public comment. Do we want to make any adjustments? Does anybody have anything they want to talk about that's not the survey or the application? Because I, I don't have a, yeah. an adjustment to the, or the agenda. Maybe. But we should do that now before we yeah. get into Yeah. Well, I was hoping, I don't know if it's already included in that, but like talk about the. The uh, informational meeting, what we learned, Ooh, and how is not that's yep. how this is going to affect where how we go forward. Why don't we do that now, just to because uh, that's not on an agenda item, but we can include that in public comment if everybody's alright with that. Yeah, because that is really important to go over. Uh, I just put on the record also that I'm really hoping to get more information from the new select board about their goals and how they plan on um, collecting these funds. You know, or requesting the funds, or the funds. So by requesting the ARPA funds, what do you mean by that? Well, you know how they have the different categories that they could use, or they can So they, like, blew up the categories according to mm -hmm. that. Yeah. yeah there's yeah. no categories yeah. anymore. Yeah. And now it's it, it's excitingly open and it's frighteningly open to so basically anything that the town wants. Right. So I'm assuming they're just going to collect the money like that um, under that one category, and then whether they still want to go through the application process and uh, comment from the town as to how they would like to spend the funds. Or are so they just going to do the this select event? board wants, has plans. You know, right. I think that's my big question for the next select board meeting, if you wouldn't mind. Yeah, I think that's a great question. That's an excellent question, because we were formed by the previous select board, and now that there's a new select board, what are their expectations of us? Yes. So and before we go the through, same, great. Yeah. Right, 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 right. If it's all the same and copacetic, then we keep rolling. But they may have, and mostly I don't, I, I want this to feel productive for all of us. Mm -hmm. Like, I don't want to sit here every first Wednesday of the month and have a stack of applications then forwarded and then go, Psh, well, we are not what we're doing anyway. <laughs> so I don't want to feel like my time is being wasted, so I feel like that's a really important, most obvious question to put to them. And I don't know if we have time on their agenda for their next meeting, but I can reach out to, I wouldn't even know who would reach out to. the chair now? Because it's so new, I don't know that they have even had a chance to yeah, yeah. So I might reach out to Chris Kodiak since he's the Because he's the continuing the longest. Longest. Yeah. So, yeah, and to see if we just fall under public comment and ask that at that time, or if we need, like, like time. Are you going to put us on your agenda time? So, I guess. Right, Nuktika, can somebody tell me? Uh, Email? We could probably just send it to the whole crew. We have the yeah. email for the, the select board. I do. You're absolutely right. So let's just so send it to the select board. Yep. I'll I do want to blanket and to us too. Mention that, you know, an impression that I got towards, I've been before the meeting, you know, we were standing chatting and all the stuff and getting electronics going. I was chatting with Robin. Something that you said, something that Robin said, something that Michael said is that, um, and, and, and we had talked about, are we going to split this up? Okay. And I was thinking, you know, we might ought to split up the municipal minus in half to the other things that haven't even been defined yet. Mm -hmm. But we know the select board is spending money, like in the town hall, to buy the electronics. They want to do the, let's see, electrification of the, 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 the digital documents at the, at the, do they? At the town hall. They yeah, want to yeah, Robin, yeah, Robin. And, and, you know, in the fire department as well, you know, wants money to replenish supplies. So I was going, well, maybe we could just say, here's the municipal stuff. Select board, you do what you're going to do with it. 
and that maybe we would continue doing what we're going to do because I highly doubt, well, I suppose they could spend the whole thing and that would be something to ask because the new stock board might have plans oh, right. for all of that money. Oh, dead, yeah, dead. and, and they, maybe this they is a pointless to, exercise. Right, right. and they talked about, Katie or Grace was talking about like slowing down and maybe doing like chunking it up like we talked about before mm -hmm. where like a certain percentage yeah. is spent and then allow people to stew and get creative with what, how they want to spend their house. I feel like they're still, um, even if they have ideas about what they want to do with the money, I feel like there's still a role for us to play in gathering the yeah. ideas from the community about how mm -hmm. they would like to see the money spent. Because it might, it was really interesting, I don't know, I. I don't know if you guys got it, but I forwarded Grace's um, message, and she. I looked at some of the surveys that went out before and how they tallied the numbers, you know, and they knew how many people from town really thought this was a priority, wasn't such a priority, not a priority at all. So yeah. having that to give them, even if they already have in their minds where how they want to spend a lot of the things, I think it's worth them having the information in hand. Hopefully they'll see it the same way. Yeah. Right. So the one the one thing I had about, you know, you know, here here's the town hall. Should we digitize the documents? Should the, we do the fire department? Should we do this? I'm like if, if you're talking fair, we need to wait all the applications in and ask people what they think. Because in the end, the select board's gonna choose no matter what that survey says. I know it might guide them, but it's like asking what do you think of this and this and this when we have fourteen things that aren't on there to ask them about. So that was my comment about the, the survey, which was a good one. Um, I just didn't, you know, like, pull out the things about where the money is to be spent. What would you like to spend it on? You yeah. Know, I don't, yeah, know, I don't think I wanted to, I, I think I wanted to put the survey out sort of before or, or maybe at the same time as the applications, just to get a feel for, are people worried about, like, our hazard plan in town or the sewerage or child care or recreation? Outdoor learning for the kids, like what? And the other thing that I, thought, I feel like there's that that we need to work with the select board because there's a big picture piece of this. Like, what is the town's? You know, this is sort of a once in a lifetime windfall or twice in a lifetime windfall. Right. How do we want it? You know, they, they talked about using the town plan. We don't have a town plan, but you know, finding starting, for example, the money can be used for grant fund you know, the, the uh, grant fund match. So if we know about grants that the, the town yeah, could the avail town. themselves of, then we use the, the money from ARPA just to be the match, and then you get a whole bunch more money. So you can, like, double your double your money that way. And they said the same for fire departments. Mm -hmm. there's the town plan, the town plan opens up so that the fire department could actually use ARPA money to match other things. Right. Than, you know, just giving them half the money. Um, I thought that was pretty cool. So because I feel like there's a lot there's for a us lot to things. maybe plumb in that yeah. department to say, like, to the select board, you know, what, these are some things that we found out that you could, if you're interested in money for the fire department, why don't we do this matching grant? Or if you're interested in money for, you know, the outdoor learning thing for the school, well, the school could apply for such and so. And that's where no longer Grace, because she's moving jobs, but Kate could... Katie can help us with. Did they ever give us links to those type? They said they could give us links to all those and grant the type things. They I didn't. Think. I don't think we got the links to the grants, but if we have targeted questions, they will link us to whatever. I did send. There are a lot of links provided in the slideshow. Yep. Yeah. Were, yeah. yeah I mean, and, and there was also the email that she sent with just like lots of mm -hmm. different questions. Yeah, it, it did sound like there was a lot of other avenues to use this money or leverage it to get more money. Yes. For certain things. And I thought that was pretty cool. So definitely our new select board. They're master grant writers. Right. So we could, I mean, imagine if we could triple this money by doing the grant right. thing. Right. Yeah. Right. You know? So it's worth more communication with this new board than as we. Well, for road projects and stuff like that, if they're able to get a grant, it's usually 80 or 90 percent the grant pays. Mm. So yeah. you can get you know, to two million dollar road project done for the amount that we're going to receive in total. Right. And I guess that again comes under highway projects. That's yeah, the there's a whole section there. on that. Right. So so it felt like to me after I left there that my head was spinning a little bit just thinking about all the possibilities and how it really 
it really gives us a lot to do. Like we might need to d divvy it up and say like, okay, you look into this department, you look into that department, because it's it's finding out what what these what what's out there. Whether it be writing to Katie and seeing what she can, and then finding out from the town what they want. You know, there's just a lot. There's a lot of like potential there, and I don't want to. I don't want us to not avail ourselves of the potential in this money, you know? Yeah, and even though master uh, grant writers are on the site, they're going to be very busy. If they wanted to use us to find their grants, to say, fire department, what about these? You know, clerk, what I'm about sorry, these? that is totally out of the scope of, I thought, what we were doing. Here, I'm just right? saying this and is you something. You know, if, if, if somebody else wants to get a grant, like the highway department wants to I'm not to get talking about us. I'm sorry. It's all right. Um, highway, fire, whomever wants to get a grant and have matching funding, I would think that they would put in an application for that. Yeah, no, it's more about giving them information, like that there is a grant. I'm not, that's all, I'm not that's, doing any grant writing. No, no, that's yeah. all I meant. Just yeah. to, to, to spread that out because the select board's busy. And right. no, I don't, I don't mean write them for them. I'm, yeah, not, I'm not a grant writer. No, so. no, this is more about information gathering so we can say, yeah. hey, someone wants to do something with the roads, we could do that. But just so you know, along with that, you could do this and then hand that application along and let them do with it what they like. Were but, they at the meeting, information yeah. meeting? So they know that that but, is a possibility. But they, it's a new select board now, so just Peter wasn't oh, yeah. there. I don't know if he came what in on was, the Zoom. What was his, uh, is the highway commissioner there, still the same? There's only one select board member. Yes. Okay. From Diana was there, yeah. right. Um, Neither Peter nor Chris was there. Or Diana was there. Diana was there and Chris so was there. Yeah. yeah. But yeah, so and when we can get that yeah, but video, just, everyone can go to yeah. it. But I was just suggesting that if we say, okay, Katie, what are these grants? Who are they for? Mm -hmm. We can pass that information on. That's all. Yeah. That, you know, because if we're if they looked at us, okay, how can we leverage this money to match in grants? Then. That might be a, re a reason for us to do the research because the select board is going to be jobs overwhelming as it is. But yeah. uh, maybe that's another question that could be asked at yeah. the next meeting. Yeah. I guess that would be a little bit of an expandive scope. So yeah. I think it's yep. worth asking <laughs> are they interested in us gathering that information? I mean, why wouldn't they be? But This one's pretty cool. Okay. I'm on the slides that you sent on the expenditure category, 6.1 provision of government services. And there's lots of different places, like you said, when somebody called or somebody sent an application for <sighs> something that we can go to this agency and they'll help you out and they'll hook you up and they'll pay for what you need. Right, like I asked them about the, my question was, because something that comes up in the select board meetings a lot is like people who just are struggling with their sewerage and living in houses that are substandard. Right. And that hurts us all because people are, you know, wastewater. And they, she said, yeah, that could be used, the ARPA funds could be used for that, but there's a whole section of funding that's exactly. coming out right now for that. So maybe don't use the ARPA funds, or if you do, use only a percentage and do the rest. So that's the kind of thing. We don't want to use our ARPA funds and then wish that it had been taken out of a different pool. Um, so. I thought it was very interesting because she really went like this with here's your options. We're yeah. Like, ah, it's crazy. It's right? amazing. It, it, it kind of, it, it went easier and harder uh -huh. all at the same time. It, it made, because it, it seemed like they. One of her, one of her, I liked one of her comments going back to what she said about, she said before you go spending this money on individuals, People needing help with you name it, right? Individuals, she says. Look in the, there's other programs with a lot of money, new money in it for that. Exactly. So as far as just as far as I'm concerned, this is this should be with all the programs she was talking about. This is more, and she even said this is more town money to yep. help the town. Yeah, that made sense. Yeah. And I guess I'm wondering because because the it seemed like the group got put together for a lot to, to help with the guidelines, like to field applications and see if they fit in the guidelines. Now there really aren't guidelines. Right. So now what do they want from us? Like what would they, what, what is our new role, you know, if, if there is one? Um, because so, it's, now it's really just about wanting to know what the town wants mm -hmm. and what the town leaders want. 
Yes. So, and and moving on from there, depending, we can offer them tools to get to where they want. Right. We can offer them the tool of the already established application. Mm -hmm. We can offer them the tool of the survey and the tool of ourselves. But until we find out what our, their expectations are of us, we're kind of starting from scratch again. So all select board members should have two out of the three. Right. Okay, so they might need a good grounding. And they well, uh, well one has been involved in town politics for years, forty years or something. But it's God we're asking sales. whether the other two know about the whole ARPA. Yes, yeah, uh, they do. Peter, Peter, Peter knows. knows. Yeah, yeah. Peter, Peter was a yeah. state senator. Right? I'm sure Diana is much more versed than Peter at this point, but Peter's pretty sharp on grant writing and. Everything. Peter, you're sharp on everything. <clears throat> okay. Oh, he's been around, you know, he's done this for a long time. Yeah, yeah. Both mm -hmm. of them have been doing this for a really long time. Sure. So, I don't know how you all feel. I feel like at this point we're kind of, kind of hanging out. We can go, everybody got this electronically. Yes. I think we're going to have to delay the date. But I right, right. That, right. Was that sent recently? Yes. yes. Okay. I don't, was it today? Yes. Okay. We can I put my back out, so I won't really do yeah. much today. Oh, damn. And in my group, we need to hold back on that. Right. Might change Ooh, all I'm going to steal that. To look yeah, that's okay. That's a good one. <laughs> well, that one you can take uh, and so the survey we all read through while Laura's reading. Um, did you get a chance to look mm -hmm. through this? Yep, yeah, right? So my favorite part of the survey was question nine, because I feel like question nine on the survey covers everything. But again, it could all be first. I don't think it's wrong either. I'm behind the times. <clears throat> oh, look at that. I'm such a dingbat. At 6.30? Do you see what the 6.30 agenda meeting, agenda item was? What was it? Review meeting with Grace and Katie. Uh -huh, Aha. We just did a public comment. <laughs> <laughs> I'm putting in the right place. I appreciate that. Thank you. Thank you very much. I, at, least was, at least it was there. I think we should actually put this on hold until we meet up with a new board Monday yeah. and see what their agenda is and see what their thoughts are. Their because yeah, because we don't know where they're going to want to go with this. No. And like you said, they with a new change of rules, they don't need us to make sure that this gets spent in the right place anymore. It's just it. And if they have there is no more rules to speak spent. of. Again, I just need reassurance that I'm not wasting my time. Right. If they want us to gather and funnel information, I'm fine with it. Then I'm yeah. fine with helping to gather information, and I'm help fine with helping to disseminate information. Yeah. But I'm. Gonna be wicked bummed out if I've spent all this time to do all of that, and you're set with a list of what one, two, three, four, five people have thought are priority, but then right, we're gonna give it to you. That this is what we think is the most important to the least important on the bottom. To just have it go, right. and then have it go look back through it again and say, well, we're just gonna. And which is fine. That that that's that, that's why we voted them, right? That's why we voted these people into the offices that they're in. And so I'm gonna but make, I don't I'm gonna them. make a motion that we don't do anything else until we go to the select board meeting uh, next Monday and see what their plans are. That's my motion. Thank you. That's I can second that one. Okay. She's second. I need to. All in favor? Well, discussion. The jar is there. Is there discussion? Anybody down? I'm only curious, when would we want to meet again? After uh, that? Same, so if they're meeting Monday, why don't we, let's look, if they're meeting Monday at 6, so Monday is March. But that, that's the first Monday of March. And they meet in the, the second. Oh, I'm sorry. The second Monday. So I didn't look at the calendar. And, and we have the camera crew here on first Wednesday of the month automatically, so we're changing. Oh, right. Our date. No. Oh, I just thought it'd be an extra meeting. If we could do an extra, oh, yeah. that we. Yeah. So they're meeting on the 14th. 
Can we meet on the 16th? Yeah, or, and or, God, it almost feels like it needs its own time with the select board, like we need to sit down. Well, this far out, I'm going to request for time on the agenda. On the 14th? Yes. And if they can't do it, they do the 28th, and then we would just meet the first Oh, if the they first can't do it, I'm going to really vote, and I'm going to strongly suggest that they find time for us. I'm sure they will. And hopefully, so let's tentatively, we'll kind of gather again by email. And I'll let everybody know what I find out and how we can get agenda time. Because you're right, they may already have their agenda set. They are a new board, they are new, but I feel like we should all, since they are new, let's all hit the ground running together. Yeah. Let's all make sure we're all on the same page, we're all brand new chapter, new year, new woohoo. So let's. And I think it's high on their priority list too, I'm sure it is. And I have a housekeeper. Free money. Could you say your motion for me again, please? My motion is to adjourn this meeting until we meet with the select board and see what their the new select board has for plans for us <clears throat> what they want to do with this money and Tara, that was my motion i forgot to ask if there'd be like any discussion that we just did <laughs> yes we just did it in reverse but we're getting the hang of it guys so with that motion uh, um, Discussion. All those in favor, say aye. 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 Uh, any negatives or nays, say nay. So I guess we're going to call this meeting now then, because we've covered everything on the agenda. It's, we'll call it 6.30, 6.29, we'll call the meeting. Um, that being said, I will get through to Chris or Robin to figure out how to get through to the select board to get on their agenda for the 14th, to which obviously... I or whomever else can attend, please do. And then I will get you by email after that, and we'll either meet the 16th, if that's still coached with everybody. Yeah. Uh, and if it's not, then we'll have to wait till the 30th, but. And I just want you to know that you covered every point. There's something for every point of your agenda. Nice. <laughs> no well done. Point, so. In a half hour. And yeah. I yeah. walked all the way around in 12. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah. Well, yeah. I'm sorry about that. Yeah. So, and for dates for me, I won't be here for, I'll be, I'm leaving on the 10th and I'll be back in about four to six weeks. So. A whole new person. A whole new person, we'll see. I'm so excited for you. <laughs> I am, I'm so excited for you. That's going to be so mean. I have no idea what's going on, but I'm excited. Oh, oh, oh thank you. <laughs> oh, can we go? There, we're Meeting adjourned? Meeting adjourned. Yes, yes.